Let me ask you something real quick. If a robot showed up at your door today, not to impress you, not to show off, but just to quietly help around the house, would you let it in? Because that's exactly the energy Onero H1 brought to CES 2026. No stage stunts, no dramatic walking sequences, no look what I can do nonsense, just a robot that feels like it already belongs in a home. Onero H1 is SwitchBot's first humanoid-style home robot, and the moment you see it, something clicks. This isn't a sci-fi character. It's not trying to be human. It's trying to be useful, and that difference changes everything. The first thing people notice? It doesn't walk. It rolls. Calmly, confidently, like it knows falling over in your living room would be embarrassing. That wheeled base isn't a shortcut. It's a decision a choice to prioritize stability over spectacle. And honestly, that might be the smartest move anyone made at CES this year. Above those wheels is a humanoid upper body with arms that can actually interact with the world, picking things up, handing you objects, helping with everyday tasks that don't need a miracle, just consistency. What really makes Onero H1 feel different though is how it thinks. This robot processes things locally, commands, reactions, decisions, handled on the device itself. No constant cloud chatter, no mystery servers. It responds fast and your home stays your home. That alone puts it in a completely different category from most smart devices we're used to. At CES, the demos were intentionally ordinary, folding laundry, unloading dishes, watching pets, delivering small items, and that's exactly why people stopped and stared, because for once, it didn't feel like a demo. It felt like a routine. And when you remember SwitchBot's background, curtains, locks, lights, it suddenly makes sense. Onero H1 isn't meant to replace your smart home. It's meant to become the physical part of it, the thing that moves, the thing that acts. And then there's the number that made everyone do a double take, around $1,000. That's not future tech pricing, that's normal people might actually consider this pricing. Now let's be clear, this isn't perfect, stairs are still stairs, real homes are messy, and long-term reliability is still an open question. But here's what matters, Onero H1 doesn't feel like a promise, it feels like a direction, a robot that isn't trying to wow you, just trying to fit in. And that might be how home robots finally win. So tell me. Does this feel like the first robot you'd actually live with? Or are we still not ready to share our space? Drop your thoughts below, and if you want more grounded takes on robots that are quietly changing everyday life, you know what to do.